Right away, man. No time to lose. December 27th, Police Department, Records Room. Dusty as always. We're only, we were only in here just yesterday. I'm sure they just haven't had time to clean. Wait, what's wrong, Miss? Nothing. I just noticed that he isn't here. Fun time, though. Oh. Let's, uh, let's look at that open drawer, shall we? Huh? One of the drawers here is open. Someone must have been looking in it recently. The label says, unsolved cases evidence. Huh, unsolved cases? Nick, the files for DL6, it's completely empty. Wait, what? What are you doing in here? Ah! Von Karma! You. How do you know my name? Huh? Have we met? What are you saying? We see each other every day, don't we? We're Miles Edwards' defense team. Defense team? <laughs> I beg your pardon. You see, I rarely remember defense attorneys. They're like bugs to me. Needless things need to, to be crushed. I can see how this guy was Edward's mentor. Um, Mr. Edward was a student, right? A romanticist who never shed the veneer of amateurism. Just like his father. Always second in ice. Mr. Von Karma. You had an axe to grind with Mr. Gregory Edwards, didn't you? Me? A grudge against the mere defense attorney? Why? Because he, he dealt a blow to your otherwise perfect trial record. So you did, but I don't. But what I don't get is, why did you take his son under your wing afterwards? The son of your most bitter rival. That, my dear attorney, is none of your business. Tomorrow will be the last day of this trial. It's been a while since I've had a defense attorney last. He's wrong. Still, you will lose in the end. Miles Edgeworth will admit to his own guilt. His guilt was 15 years ago, you mean? You cried, you're quite the zoo researcher. If, you're done, if you've done your homework so well, then certainly you must understand. You know that what, Miss, what Miles Edgeworth will tell the court tomorrow. We were right. So, Von Karma is going to bring up the 06 in court tomorrow. How about this letter you wrote, dude? Mr. Von Karma, have a look at this. This is what. This was you, wasn't it? You instructed Yanni Yogi to commit murder. Yanni Yogi? How many years has it been since I've heard him called by that name? He's a fool. I told him to burn it after he read it. So you admit it. You, you wrote Mr. Yogi this letter. Yes, my dear defense attorney. Thank you for taking the trouble to bring it to me. You saved me a lot of needless hassle. What? Nick, what, what is that thing? Aye, a stun gun for self-defense, usually. Indeed. 600,000 volts will go through your body like a dog touching an electric fence. 
Okay. That... Why, why would you carry around a taser with you, man? 600 shot. Oh, don't worry. People don't die from it. Usually. Now give me that letter. No! No! What are you? Nick, run! Maya! Out of my way! Uh, he got us. The letter's gone, for, of course. And he took the DL6 evidence. All of it. Back to having no clues. Wait. Maya jumped first. Maya! Is she okay? My- Maya! Maya, open your eyes. Maya. Well, that, the letter. Did he take it? Huh? Oh, yeah. Are you okay? I I couldn't stop him. I jumped so fast as I jumped as fast as I could, but one shot from that thing knocked me out cold. I'm useless. I'm, I'm no good as a lawyer or as a medium. I can't even tell call my sister. I'll be right back. To call this part here. Um, yeah, this has been the Professor Tony with another objection. So, bye, Zeus. <laughs>